Okay, so in this case, we're going to look at a few things. Let's pick up a different pen. Okay, so what we're looking at here is the parenthetical citations. And these are the items that come at the end of a quote. So if you look in this little excerpt, we have two items here from somewhere inside somebody's paper. So if you look at this, let's pretend that this parenthetical citation is the first one we come across in this paragraph. So if we look at this, Austin 269 is perfect. It is the author's last name with a space and then a page number. That's good there. There should be no comma inside. There should be no P period, no word page, nothing like that. This is great. But the one thing that is incorrect is this period here. Period appears at the end of the citation, okay? Because that citation is included in the statement. So when you think of ending a statement with a period, you include everything that belongs in that statement. So it is the quote, the quoted materials, the parenthetical citation, Austin 269, and then the period comes at the end of that. Okay, so that's one little mistake right here. The second thing we're looking at as we go through this paper, we come down and we see that there is a second quote with a second parenthetical citation, which is great. So here's where the quote starts. Here's where the quote ends. We just spoke about the period, so we do know that we will cross off the period here and it would be at the end of the parenthetical citation. But there's a secondary issue going wrong here in this second or third or fourth or fifth quote. Think for a minute, do you know what it is? Can you see it right away? Okay, what it is is, since we've used Austin, the author's name already one time, and in this particular case, we're only using this one source, we no longer need to write Austin because we already know every quote you're using in this case is going to be from Austin. So you write Austin and the number the first time. And then any time after that, since you're not changing sources, it's always going to be from Austin. So you only then need to do the number. So in this case, it would be N, N quotation mark here. And then your parenthetical citation would just be a page number with an ending period mark.